Welcome back to Mountain Connections. Jim Bisley is here from Park City Rental Properties. He always has the best properties, the up and coming ones, the greatest designs, everything you want to see. And today we're going to talk about properties in Park City and Sedona. Thanks so much, Jim, for being here. Thank you. Great to see Good you. To it's see been a long you. time. It has been a long time. Yeah. So I'm curious, we have you on the show quite a bit. When did this all start? Uh, it, you know, it's funny. Uh, we're going, coming on our 20th anniversary, so we're going to have a couple specials next time I'm on the show just to talk a little bit about that with guests. So 20 years ago, 1999. Wow. So what made you decide to go into this business? Uh, you know, originally, I, um, you know, we uh, started buying properties here, and I couldn't find a good property manager. We were in the medical field, and I just decided that, um, you know, heck, I think I could do it better. <laughs> so, so we started a website. We started managing our own properties, and, you know, you know, and then here we are 20 years later still doing it. I love it. You're doing great, and you recently won another award. We Congratulations. Did. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, yeah. So they had the Park City's Best, so we won Best Vacation Rental Manager, and we also won Best Property Manager, so it's the fifth year in a row. We're super excited about that. And I'm glad you mentioned property management, because on this show, we talk a lot about rental properties mm -hmm. and showcase really all the great ones you have, but you're also in property management. Yeah, yeah, we do We do it all. You know, we do, we do second home management. We can do long-term rentals, short-term rentals. Um, we do focus a lot on vacation rentals because that's a really big aspect of what we do here, but we are happy to help with anything that, uh, that an owner needs, for sure. So I'm curious, when you go on vacation, do you ever actually go on vacation since vacation is your business? <laughs> yeah, you know, we travel around, you know, we do have, we have some small destinations in Hawaii and Sedona, Scottsdale, and uh, Austin, Texas too, and Dripping Springs, a beautiful, beautiful oh, area. Beautiful. So, uh, and we'll probably have some properties for you to look at later on there, but those are just, we really feel like we have the beach, the mountains, we have the zen experience in Sedona, the desert experience, and then you've got that ranch experience in Texas. So it's kind of cool because we have um, probably 250,000 repeat customers, wow. and we want to show them not just that Park City is a wonderful place, but all of these destinations are really incredible places, and they're still going to get the most amazing experience over the top luxury type properties too. Oh, definitely. I, you really have some great properties. Let's get right sure. into it and sure. show some great properties. This is Comstock 201. Sure, yeah, this is a great property. It's at Lower Deer Valley. This is a two bedroom, two bath, about 1,250 square feet, sleeps six guests, beautiful views. It's an easy walk to Snow Park Lodge there in Lower Deer Valley. And it's one of the only air conditioning, uh, air conditioned units there too, which is <laughs> kind of super nice in the summer, but gorgeous. You know, most of these are in that kind of a little bit more of a rustic mountain look. And um, they really do come out amazing in a great location. Great location, you can't go wrong, and yeah. very well done. Yeah. All right, we have the Brownstone Penthouse up next. Yeah, and I don't know if you know those Brownstone ones, but they are really cool. They're at the top of Main Street, and these are all brand new, total mountain contemporary design, right around 2nd and Main Street, so you can walk down to Town Chair Lift, you can get on Sweeney Switchback, you're right on Main Street. It's a three bedroom, four bath, 2,700 square feet, sleeps nine guests. With this one, you also get a 10% discount card to River Horse Provisions and also preferred VIP seating and reservations at River Horse as well. I don't, have oh, you, have you, you, um, you've probably been to River Horse. Yes. It's my I favorite think, restaurant by far in like town. Like most romantic restaurant, I think. Yeah, yeah. They won a couple awards as well mm -hmm. the other night mm -hmm. too, and I just absolutely love it. So the, um, the next two actually come with that same type of package. Oh, nice. Yeah. And up next is the Imperial Penthouse. Yeah, and this is right above River Horse Provisions, which is a really cool restaurant and grocery store at the top of Main Street. This is um, about 3,000 square feet. It's a four bedroom, four and a half bathroom property. Also, you can see, tricked out to the max, beautiful mountain, contemporary design. It sleeps up to 12 guests and you do get that 10% dining card at River Horse Provisions and also preferred seating at River Horse as well. I love how your properties are a good mix between that kind of mountain lodge traditional mm -hmm. and mountain contemporary. Yeah get some great ideas for our own homes and also enjoy just spending time in a beautiful setting. I get a lot of ideas for my house. You yeah. know, I go through and I'm like, wow, this is super cool. And, and you know, some people really like that kind of mountain contemporary. Other ones want that rustic, lodgy feel. And we basically have everything on the, every edge of the spectrum. Everything. All right, we have another one to show. Mm -hmm. This is Sedona. Sure. Let's yep. Sorry, oh, Silver Star. Oh, oh we yeah. don't want to go to Sedona yet. Sorry, oh, yeah. jump the gun. Park City <laughs> first. So let's sure. look at Silver Star right yeah, now. Yeah, and Silver Star is a beautiful ski and ski out community um, right there at Park City Mountain Resort. This one in particular is a true ski and ski out, three bedroom, three and a half bathroom, 
um, condo, single level condo, absolutely gorgeous on the inside. This is kind of a mix. It's right between that mountain rustic contemporary and, and more modern contemporary look. But these are really nice new units that sleeps eight guests. Um, you get all of the amenities at Silver Star as well. So they've got the hot tubs, they have the fitness centers, true ski and ski out, and then Silver Star Cafe is there, which is also another one of my favorite little great outdoor dining restaurants. So. How do you accumulate all of these great properties? You know, people a lot of times they just go to our websites and um, a lot of real estate agents in town also refer to us because they have some great clients. And so, um, yeah, yeah, I just, you know, the word kind of gets out over time. So we, uh, we do our best to also try and find really good luxury properties. We want, we want things that when guests come here, they have an incredible experience, both with our concierge services, but comfortable beds, you know, great locations, all that kind of stuff is super important to us for repeat business too. And you have all of that. All right, I've actually been thinking about going to Sedona. So oh, Sedona really? on the brain. So yeah. now we're going to focus on Sedona. Have you been to Sedona? Sedona? No. Oh, man. No, it is an I incredible, yeah. It is a majestic, magical place in the mountains around 4,000 square feet and uh, 4,000 square feet, 4,000 feet in elevation. Oh, beautiful. Um, beautiful red rocks like you have in Moab, but also a bunch of pine trees and all this really wonderful stuff. Great restaurants, amazing mountain biking, rivers running through it. <laughs> And then this kind of um, real earthy feel because they have, it's one of the four vortexes of the world. So a lot of magnetic energy, self-healing, meditation, yoga, women's retreats, this sort of thing are very, very popular in Sedona. Wow. Yeah. I'm there. I'm, yeah. I'm going to go. Right Great now. wineries too. So. so let's look at Pegasus Ranch, a <laughs> sure. property you have in Sedona. Yeah. It's spectacular. This is a great one. This is on three acres. It is six bedroom, four and a half bathrooms and it sleeps up to 17 guests. The owner has done an amazing job with this. From top to bottom, he has some great furniture, TVs, all Tempur-Pedic beds, but it's sitting in this uh, area called Jack's Canyon where you have all the red rocks surrounding you on all sides. You have three acres, so what a great family retreat and a fun place to stay. And some beautiful views on that one. Yeah, everything in Sedona, you're just like, it's like, wow. It's kind of like Park City, you're like, wow. Wow, wow. <laughs> <laughs> and we have one more property in Sedona to yeah. show you, Soul Shack. Yeah, Let's take yeah. a look at that one. Yeah, this one, the Soul Shack is really cool. This is a three bedroom, two bath property, 2,000 square feet, and it has uh, sleeps up to 12 guests. And the owner has also gutted this from top to bottom, made it a gorgeous, what we call Sedona contemporary. Beautiful, beautiful views uh, all the way across the board and does sleep 12 guests, great backyard. Uh, you can kind of see from the pictures, it's really an amazing property. We do have one like one uh, one other one that might be on the list there. I'm not sure if it is, but we have the Sedona Majestic. I'm not the sure if they We have. do have the Sedona Majestic. You do? Yes. yes this yes. one is over the top. Um, this one here is a three bedroom, can be converted and used as a four bedroom. It basically has um, uh, three bedrooms, but somewhat four bedrooms, four and a half bath, 5,300 square feet and it, it has um, views to die for all the way around, big pool that, that basically overlooks all of the mountains and everything, and they're kind of just pulling some of the pictures from our website here, but you can see it is really tricked out, and um, the owners are fantastic people. They have spared no expense to make this what we consider to be the best property in Sedona, and if you're looking to sleep somewhere around eight people, this is your place for sure. I like how these Sedona properties have kind of that bohemian kind of vibe, but at yes. the same time, very contemporary, very modern, just mm -hmm. a great mix of materials and yeah. styles. It's funny because Park City has that Mount Contemporary, Sedona's the Sedona Contemporary. They all have that same feel, but they're super cozy, very luxury type properties. And you know, that's the kind of product we like to offer for guests. It's something that's, you know, you want, we want them to come back. We want them to tell their friends what a great experience they have and, and uh, see us every year, you know. So how far are you booked out? If you want to go to Sedona or Park City or any of your uh, other great locations and great properties, how far in advance do you need to be planning your trips? You know, for like Christmas and New Year's, I would plan right now. <laughs> so there's no question, we're probably 50% booked up for Christmas and New Year's already. So if somebody's planning those busy holiday times, certainly plan further in advance. If you have larger groups, definitely plan further in advance. Sedona, usually it's about 60 day window roughly, except for all the holidays. It's incredible there in the spring and fall, although the winter is really amazing. Here, of course, we're known for the winter, but everybody comes back for the summers. So my personal opinion is like September, October to me is my favorite time of year. And I still think that's a less traveled time in, uh, in this town. So people got to come check out our 
changing of the leaves. Yeah, you really can't go wrong here. Yeah, I agree. I mean, I'm biased. But <laughs> Me too. <laughs> so we showed your website a couple of times, but one more time, shout out of the website. If someone sees a property they want to stay in or just wants to browse, sure, where sure. Uh, Parkcityvacationrentals.com, or we also have branded now I love Parkcity.com. Sedona, we have Sedona.org, and we also have I love Sedona.com. So um, that's kind of a couple of our brands, and if they ever forget, they can always just uh, call us toll free uh, at the office as well anytime from the websites. Oh, perfect. Well, thanks so much, Jim, Thank for being you. here, and congratulations once again. You guys are really doing an incredible job, working hard, and it's showing. Thanks so much. Great to be here. All right, check out Park City Rental Properties. Really, you saw from the pictures, spectacular places you can stay in Park City and Sedona, the ones we highlighted today. But also, as Jim mentioned, they have places all over the country. Go check them out. You won't regret it, and you'll have a great vacation. More Mountain Connections right after this.